a couple of years back, I tested the weight of my DJI Mini 2 using strobes. This is the Flytron Cree strobe. I've got two of them here. And a couple of years ago, I weighed these on top of the Mini 2 to see if it took the weight over 250 grams. I'm going to do that again today and I'm also going to test the weight with the Mini 3 and the two, two strobes from Flytron Cree. I'm also going to test the weight of the Mini 2 and the Mini 3 using the Ulanzi white strobe, which I, I know from previous experience is double the weight of one of these, which is equivalent to the <laughs> two of them. So I'm going to test them all out now. And I'm going to use a set of precision scales that I have here, just so that we can see what the weight is without any of the strobes, and then I'll add the strobes to it, so that you're absolutely sure of what weight you are if you decide to use a combination of a combination of uh, of these strobes, right? And you won't worry about going over 250 grams, or you might. So let's see what they all weigh. So here's the scales weighing zero, and if we put the Mini 2 on top of the scales with the battery, we have 239 grams. So let's add one of the strobes, 242, and another strobe, 246 grams. So there we go, with two strobes still under the weight, if you then add the Ulanzi, it's now taking you slightly over by three grams. If you take off one of the Crees, there you go. So you can have a Ulanzi and a Cree and be at 250 grams. So let's try the DJI Mini 3 Pro now with the battery. The drone weighs. <laughs> ah! Let's put the battery in. <laughs> okay, so with the battery, the drone weighs 250 grams, that's, oh, 249 grams. So straight away, it's gonna tell you that if I add a crease strobe, it is gonna take you over the weight 